12 months of administrative leave, Jeff Taff, a Burlington High School social studies teacher, is cleared to return to the classroom this fall. <laughs> Days prior to crowds storming the U.S. Capitol on January 6th, Taff shared a note with students in Google Classroom saying he would be in Washington, D.C. for a few days, writing, some of you will understand why, some will not, and I'm sorry, but standing up for election integrity and our right to vote in fair elections is too important for me not to be there. The district hired an outside law firm to conduct an investigation, which concluded on Thursday that Taft did not violate board policies or state and federal laws as it pertains to any alleged discrimination and found no evidence that Taft engaged in any unlawful activity. Hi there, Mr. Taft. Hi there. Terry Sater from Channel 12. Okay. Are you guys recording right now? Yeah. Yeah, we yeah. are. Okay. Could you please remove yourself from my property? February was the one and only time Taff appeared on camera with 12 News. His attorney asked us not to contact Taff on Thursday and instead sent out a statement that read in part, Jeff looks forward to returning to the classroom next school year and would like his students and community to know that truth trumps accusation. The district said Taff would participate in professional development related to culturally responsive education. Though some parents I talked to said this isn't the first time students have felt uncomfortable with Taff. Are they going to send him to like, what, a 30 hour online class and give him a non-existent slap on the wrist and he's been on paid vacation this entire time? What would you want to say to Jeff Taff if he's listening? Straighten up. Um, realize that these are children and one of my children was in your class and he felt uncomfortable. Um, he was just too scared to say anything about it. In Burlington, Caroline Reinwald, WYSN 12 News.